Hello everyone, this is Nana. So, like I said, I was, I'm going to um, talk about uh, Rutaro and all that stuff. Um, well, first of all, this is what happened with me. So, I woke up and automatically when I wake up, I look at my phone and look at the millions of texts, tweets that go through. If Gene decides he's going to, like, spam up my phone, then normally I have, like, 50 messages. If Yushiro does writing both back and forth with Gene, normally I get 100. No, I've actually not gotten it through 100. So anyway, I was looking through the messages, and I saw a comment by, um, some might know, uh, might know him, but his name is, uh, online is Kamichan. By the way, if you want to go and read his blog, go to kamichan.com. Kami as in like God, and Chan as in like Chan, Chan at the end of a name for Japanese, Chan. And then obviously .com, and just that, it's really easy to find him. Uh, then I suggest looking at him and whatever. Uh, so, well, I woke up and he wrote down Rutaro, something about like or something about how it's gone crazy in whatever Rutaro, we've done it, blah blah blah, something like that. And that was like the only message I saw. Um, so I ran downstairs and opened up my computer and looked. There was nothing on Heisei.com. There is nothing anywhere. So I was like, okay, well, I have to go to the Japanese uh, fandom because there's nowhere. I could find anything in English. So I went on the Japanese fan place, um, and I saw Ru Ru um, the first post that was on one of the sites was, uh, I think it was, like, n not news, I forgot what the word is, but it was, like, important or something like that. Like, it was, like, everyone should read this, or maybe, I think, maybe something along the lines like that. Um... And so then I looked through some of the messages and I saw Rue's name and then I noticed um, the char the character for smoking and I was like, what? What's going on? And then so after I went through many of the messages, I realized that um, about what happened and I was like, what? So I decided, then I was reading through them and I said that tomorrow, which at the time it was 11 o'clock at night in Japan the day before they were putting out the, the magazine, but all that information was already put out before the magazine even was let out, the page and everything. And so I just, I typed in on um, Google or Yahoo Japan, uh, Morimoto Rutaro smoking, and I found the picture. So then I took the picture and I asked people of a Facebook community we have a little place, and I asked them if I'm allowed to post it up. Um, one person didn't know exactly what it meant, and the president of it told me I could put post it up. So I posted it up, and then that's when it just, like, kind of, like, it. I don't think anyone was ready for, obviously, we're not ready for finding out about what happened. So then... After that, uh, I went to class and stuff, and I was kind of worried, but I wasn't too worried. I was thinking, he looks young, uh, I don't think he would be punished very badly, but I was wrong. I, after, I happened to get out of the, class, the first class early, um, and I was still stalking the Johnny, uh, Japan fandom. Um, and then I went to my next class, and I just happened my teacher wasn't there, but we had to still do class. So, um, I got into a computer lab, and I was looking through more posts and stuff, and, um, Arama, they didn't, uh, mentioned, put out the information about what Johnny said and whatever, about how he's being suspended. Um, so... Like, literally, I had my phone in my hand, and I dropped it, and my friend was like, because I already told her already what was going on. She's like, what happened? I'm like, he's being suspended. 
he's and then I got freaked out and I kind of told a lot of people that he was being kicked out of the group. Um, right now, I have thought it through and I don't think he's going to be permanently kicked out. Um, my personal opinion, I think he'll be gone for maybe a few months, maybe a year or so, to let it blow over. Um, so yeah. Um, either way. I have a lot of theories, but I can't really say a lot of them on here because I don't want to say something and people take it as truth. Um, if you ever actually want to see any of my theories, I normally post them up on Facebook um, or Twitter. Twitter, I don't do it as much because I only could use it in 140 uh, characters and that's not going to work. So anyway, um, before I actually had a like in my head a thing I wanted to tell Johnny um you probably won't see this but I don't think he should suspend him I think mm. anyway I can't really say much about that stuff but I want to tell you please don't blame Johnny please don't blame him because Everyone, he's the owner of the company. Yeah, he makes the last decision, but you gotta understand that there's other people that pressure him to not do something, to do something. So he's not the only person. There's probably other people who are um, telling him, like Johnny, you, you can't do this, whatever. And another thing, I won't go into much details about all that because. I've ranted enough about it, and I and I think the only people I really should tell are people that I know won't be, who know who I am, and know that I won't, that I come up with many theories and um, stuff. I was so freaked out that day I couldn't go to work. Um, I got home and I talked to fans, and that calmed me down because I needed to talk to the fans and to calm them down because it was getting hectic. Um, I'm, I'm trying my best to connect the Japanese fandom and the f uh, foreign fandom. Um, so, yeah. So, since uh, I actually wrote something um, for class today for I had to do a special occasion speech. Um, but it was basically, it's based off of um, Ru. And a lot of my friends told me it was actually really good. So I decided I was going to read it on here. Hello everyone, my name is Nana. Every night you would look into the stars and say, I would like to be just like them. You are never an adventurous child to reach your hands up and ask to touch, and ask to touch the stars. You wanted to be them. So I asked myself, how is this, how is this possible? How can a child become a star? The day you started on this dream was seven years ago. Everyone around you was bigger and more experienced in becoming a star, but you were determined to get your dream. Then finally, one day, you were able to join a cluster of stars, ten to be exact. You're not the least experienced star, but you happen to be the youngest. Many of the other stars are brighter than you. Many of the humans on the ground noticed your cluster of stars just because of those other stars. After, after almost four years in this cluster, you try to show your talents, but the only star, stars the humans saw were the two bright ones in the middle. You asked yourself, why can't I be a bright, bright star like them? May, maybe I shouldn't have become a star. Maybe I shouldn't try to become a star. Then one day, out of anger, you cast yourself down on earth, thinking the way it was the way to gain attention. You successed, but at the risk of never returning to your cluster of stars. Once you fell to earth, you looked around at the humans. Many of them started crying, saying, Why did you do that? Your, cl your cluster isn't complete. You looked at the cluster and saw an empty hole. That once was you and you really realize that it wasn't those two stars in the middle that made it bright, but all ten of you. My name is Nana, 
and I have known this star for only four years, but in those four years I have become so close. You might not be the favorite star, but you complete my favorite cluster. So I give you this award, Rutaro, for being a super duper star. So yeah, um, well I actually technically just said this just for Ryu, but, um, more likely he won't be seeing this message, and more likely, uh, he won't even understand, so there's no really point, um, of saying this, but, I want to show you guys just a few words that, you know, even if you're in the fandom and you don't have any friends that are in the fandom, we're all there for you, and even if you don't care about the foreign fans, the Japanese people are, Japanese fans are still with you. Things they say in Japan are really similar to what they say in the foreign fandom. We're not connected completely. We don't know any of the fans. We can't talk to them. But we all have the same feelings. So yeah. Do your best, guys. Um, Ru is doing his best, too. Um, what else? I'm probably going to make another video that's more not as kind of set. Um, and this is more like a, good luck everyone, please do your best. Um, please still support Heisei Jump no matter what. Really, just support them. Um, no matter if it's ten members or nine members. We should not punish the other Heisei Jump members because Ru is not there. I mean, he's not there right now. But you shouldn't say, oh, I won't listen to Heisei Jump just because... He's not there. It's not their fault. You shouldn't punish them. Um, I also want to say congr congratulations to Heisei Jump for selling over 10,000 copies on the first day and have been has increased it up to over 150,000 um, today. Um, let's hope that they do very well and Good luck to them. I'm looking forward, um, well, the, my feeling right now is I'm kind of, kind of scared, uh, because, um, well, it will really hit when, as soon as it gets to the time where it's after what happened with Rue, with seeing Heisei Jump. Right now, all the stuff that we're going to see are all pre-recorded -rec -rec before any of this stuff happened. So, it's going to be an odd experience. It's as odd as what happened in Japan with this uh, tsunami. It's like, it's, there was pre-recorded stuff, and then after it, they, they were two different things. Two different feels to the show. That will be the time where it really hits us. Um, right now, I really don't think it's as extreme. Um, and definitely when he comes back, I am positive he'll come back. I feel it not just in my heart, just logically, just I feel like it will happen. So, um, but when he comes back, I think that will be the time. You might think you cried now. But I think you definitely cry more when he comes back. So, thank you for watching.